I think we should be feeling guilty. I always tell myself, looking at my own self, that I've been reading Salah for I don't even know how many years. May Allah accept it from us. When I'm reading Salah, am I able to concentrate on the meanings of the words? If the answer is yes, Alhamdulillah. If not, well, I've been reading Salah for 30 years, perhaps, perhaps more than that. How can I not know the meaning of the words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala when I, and the meanings of what I say in my prayer when I've been praying for the last 30 years? 30 years. And believe me, if the government came up with a new tax law, every businessman would never sleep before he knew the details of what is expected from him tomorrow morning. Why? Because, hey, I don't want my money to, to be touched. My brothers and sisters, today, we are more interested in cosmetics to look after the body that is going to be buried under the grave than that which is required to look after the soul that is going to go beyond the grave. Allahu Akbar. If I have a pimple on my head, right here, I noticed it this morning, and I told myself, Subhanallah, that's Allah. Perhaps I had a bit of peanut butter last night. May Allah grant us ease. So it's amazing how we are so interested. You look at it and you say, I have a pimple here. How? Wow. How am I going to stand in front of what about standing in front of Allah? Our whole heart, not a pimple, but it looks like one big wart. May Allah protect us. We don't even have a heart. Why? It is completely destroyed. Everything we've been doing is something far away from the message of the Quran. To cure that, Allah says, Shifa'un lima fi sudur. We have sent you the Quran. In it, there is a cure for what is in the heart. For what is in the chest, meaning the heart. For what is in the chest. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala cure our hearts. So my brothers and sisters, let me repeat what I've just said, just in order to motivate us. Sometimes we are more interested in the appearance of the body that is going to be buried in the grave than the appearance of the soul that is going to take us beyond that grave. Remember this. And how do I beautify the soul? By beautifying the link with the word of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This is the importance of the Quran.